Hi everybody. Um, I just ordered an Invicta 9403 Pro Diver with Coke bezel. Finally came in. I just wanted to just check it out. I have a Kershaw knife just to open the box. Let's go and see how it how it looks. comes in the Invicta box, yellow box. It has a nice red and black bezel, brand new. Wait, I'm trying to turn the bezel, but it doesn't want to turn right now. Maybe I gotta try to look into it. Maybe return it. Maybe I can fix it. I'm not too sure. I'll go contact the seller. But here you go. I know I'm going to have more videos to maybe try to fix this bezel. I know I'm going to have more videos to take off this uh State window, the magnify magnifier. But anyway, here's just the un unboxing of the of the watch. Ooh. Has a Invicta warranty card and instructions and warranty. All in all, this is. Uh, besides the bezel not working right now. Uh, yeah. It does have hacking. That's amazing for how cheap I bought this. I bought this for only $75. That's a great... That's a great option to have for such a cheap price. Yes, the retail says it's for $315, but I remember buying this type of watch back in the day when it used to be on Shop NBC. Shop NBC used to always make it sound such a good deal. Made you want to buy everything. Oh, boy. I bought these for $100 with the Miyota Mi movement. With the Miyota movement. They're great. Well, I wasn't making very much at the time. Neither am I making... A killing now but nonetheless um for seventy five dollars free shipping through eBay how can I go wrong? Still cheaper than what I bought I bought it for at least thirteen to fifteen years ago and the build quality is actually not but that bad you can see it has a solid bracelet but it's not a solid ending what can you do for $75 it is a screw down screw down crown Take that thing off. Very first one. It's just to wind the watch. Second one is for the date. Wait.
third one is to adjust your time and it is a hacking movement as you see the second hand has stopped once I put it all the way out that's a terrific feature especially at a price of especially for a watch at this price point I do have more watches but I just wanted to try check out this uh, Invicta even though if I do have a couple more that I do have to start making a video about those are old this is brand new so I figure start off with a brand new one and it does have a uh, the Invicta logo on the crown, which is a good detail. This, I believe, has a Seiko movement inside. How can I go wrong with this type of price? Uh, to get the crown back on is... Not as smooth as some other watches I have. Uh, thank you. Um, after I kept on playing with the bezel, it finally started to work. It's 120 click. This is actually a very good buy for something $75 that has a Seiko movement this is the Invicta Pro Diver with the coke bezel the bezel isn't as uh, smooth as I would want it to be but really at $75 can't complain um Let's go take off all these tags since I was thinking about returning it and the bezel's working now so it's it's all good from now. It's basically mine. It, it has a cheapy pressed metal for the clasp. It's not as far from the best but It does its job. Let's take off all of this. The bracelet has looks like a brush finish on either side. The center is polished. It's a nice looking bracelet in general. I had no complaints when I have two others that like this. It won't compete against the higher end watches, but for a daily uh, watch that can take you and f take you to work and home, do whatever chores as needed. It. Really, this is a very great beater for a brand new watch. Uh, that's what this watch is going to be for me. Because, oh, I had no idea I had this. It's been a while since I bought a brand new watch. There you go, that's much easier. I have not sized this yet, but let's see it on the wrist.
Well, I'm rather impressed that all this is. Still, I'd like to get to know this Seiko movement that's in here. I'll follow up with more re with more videos later. Thank you.